this video, we're gonna talk about five reasons why I decided to go all in on the painting business. Number one, there's low startup cost, which means there's low risk. Most businesses, if you just Google it, most businesses take a couple years to start to earn a profit because there's a lot of money you gotta put up front and then you gotta get things going and you gotta pour money into it. With the painting business, you can be up and running for very little startup cost, which means there's very little risk to you because you don't have much startup cost. Number two, let's talk profit and cash flow. So in the painting industry, there's really nice profit margins. There's a lot of industries out there and businesses out there with razor thin margins. In the painting industry, you can get some really nice, healthy profit margins, which means because you have low startup costs and you have high profit margins, that means you can turn a profit really quickly. That's how I was able to make $4,000 in profit after paying off my startup costs in my very first month in business when I started my company. And once you're in business, you've got really good positive cash flow. We take a deposit when we sell a job. We take a final payment when we get the job completed. We make positive cash flow when a job is sold and when a job is completed. So it's a really positive cash flow business, which is really, really nice. Number three, there's a really low level of competition. There's a lot of competitors. So there's a lot of painting contractors out there, but the level of competition is quite low. And if you're gonna enter a, an industry or a new business, what you need to be focused on doing is we've gotta be better than people who are already out there getting business. All you've gotta do is talk to anyone who's a homeowner who's hired any contractor to find out, man, contractors really aren't doing a great job for their customers out there. Everyone's got horror stories about contractors and the painting industry is no different. So the level of competition is relatively low and it's not very hard to be one of the best companies out there by doing what you say you're gonna do, being professional, following proven business principles and practices. There's a lot of ways that you can immediately be better than a lot of the competition that's already out there. You don't need to be the best, you just gotta be better than the worst that's out there and there's a lot of bad contractors out there. Number four, it's a massive growing market and it's not going anywhere. The painting industry has been around for a long, long time and it's gonna to continue to be around for a long, long time. We're a long ways away from painting disappearing as an industry. It's absolutely massive. There's billions and billions of painting being done every single year. Every year, more buildings are being built. Every single building, you drive down the road and every single structure you see needs to be painted inside and out on a repeating basis. So we've got this market that is just never going anywhere and, and every day it's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Number five, it's not sexy. This is a huge benefit to the painting industry is that it's not a sexy business to be in. Sexy businesses are tech, software, startups, the hip new cool business, the innovative new idea. That's all really cool and it's sexy and it's fun to talk about and it looks good when you're talking about it. Painting is not that. It's not a sexy business, which is a huge advantage because people aren't pouring in to this industry and it still amazes me because it's a multi-billion dollar industry with a low level of competition and a ton of opportunity and great profit margins and it's not going anywhere those sexy cool hip ideas they might fizzle out they might be out innovated in two years our industry is not going anywhere and as someone who's been in the painting industry for 17 years it amazes me how often i see a lot of the most successful people leave our industry for something that looks sexier you know, someone builds a really big painting company and then leaves to go into roofing, or they leave to go into real estate, or they leave to go into something else. It's like, nobody wants to be here. And those of us who really sit in this industry, there's just a huge, huge opportunity. So those are five reasons that makes the painting industry a really lucrative, really attractive industry to be in.